ladies and gentlemen, welcome to week 11, Breaking the Fourth Wall. I'm your host, Junior Ruiz, alongside my co-host, David Sanchez. Welcome to our reboot extravaganza. Uh, wacky inflatable hand guy. What is it? Oh, wacky, wacky, wacky wavy. Wacky waving inflatable arm tube man. Yeah. Yep. All right, so reboot extravaganza. Let's start it off with the king. King Conan. King Conan. Oh, my God. That poster from the cans blew my mind. I didn't even... Dude, did that poster not look like Tom Hanks? Oh, yeah, hey, I can see I it I thought now. that was Tom Hanks. I can see it now, yeah. And I'm like, oh, wait, that's Arnold? I yeah. swear I thought that was Tom Hanks. Oh, I can see that. Like, he never got off that uh, that deserted island. You know? And he has, like, an army of, like... Beach balls, uh, beach volleyballs balls. Yeah, and shit. <laughs> all these drifted balls. <laughs> <laughs> I swear I thought that was Tom Hanks, man. I'm excited about it. Um, they locked down a, a, good, a good script, a good script writer for it. I, f- I forget her name, but she, uh, she did a, a novel about the, the World Trade Centers. Um, so it, so it has, so, uh, you know, it's going to have like some serious tones to it. And then they got the motherfucking director from the Fast and the Furious saga. So it's going to be like serious plot a lot with, of with, with mindless action and a like a lot of horse chasing a lot of horse chasing <laughs> and they're gonna kick on the nas <laughs> um actually that that kind of kind of worries me i didn't even see the the last few fast and the furious movies i've seen uh, the latest one how, how were the the last ones like like after part two is the, the first one with the rock tokyo drift was the weakest so that's is it once tokyo drift came out i was like oh that's it no no tokyo drift I'm was the weakest here. But then four was good, and then five with the rock was good. Wasn't the rock in the last two? Yeah, five and six. Okay, seven is the one that's still being worked on. Okay, so part five it was pretty good with the rock. So what we've got so far is that uh, King Conan. He's already been Conan for a long time, and I guess that's how they're they're adjusting for for Arnold's age. And uh, the, something something comes forward to challenge peace in the kingdom, and now he must he must find it within himself. To find the barbarian that he used to be. That's base. That's the basis of the movie so far. That's so it's like right now. Rocky Balboa. It's like it's was Balboa. Rocky Six or whatever uh, it was. No, it's the one they actually called. Rocky, right, Rocky, Rocky Balboa. Balboa. Yeah, that's oh, what I meant. Rocky, it was right, Rocky it was his Balboa. Full name, right? Yeah. So King Conan, <laughs> where he's like retired, and then the young up and comers is like, you know, hey, I because you know, they had the the video game simulations. So I actually wouldn't be surprised to see uh, a sliced alone. But see, Rocky production. lost though. He lost that fight. Remember, he lost. He so lost. is King Conan gonna? I. You know what? Maybe, man. Get to the chop. Get to the horse. You know what? I, what I think is gonna be in order to to kind of continue the series without having to reboot it. I think. It's gonna start off like right away. The new enemy's there, and while while that's happening, while he's and since he's trying to search for his inner barbarian, he flashbacks a lot. Mm. So there has to be a young a young Conan. Oh yeah, yeah. Who's yeah. gonna be young Conan? They can't show they can't show flashbacks with like freaking the young previous, Arnold the and like a uh, uh, young James Earl Jones. You remember that one? <laughs> when he was like the Snake King. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, because I just thought about like like some some new fan being like, oh, that guy's better than I just saw. <laughs> Let's bring him back. <laughs> yeah, no, no, but I'm, I'm very excited for it. It's getting a lot of positive feedback. Um, the last Conan movie, uh, I I didn't watch it. I'll be I honest. It I heard it was like like mostly just just violence. You're not going in there for the acting. Okay. I love the but that but that trilogy. was but that was yeah that was like the the old Conan movies too. What about um, Arnold still had his crazy ass accent? Do we have a a, a general release date like uh, at least the time frame? No, yeah. because they were supposed to release this year. Oh really? Yeah, it was. Oh, that's right, because the movie's done. Or was it just the poster that debuted? It was just the poster that debuted. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. But it was supposed it was supposed to be out already, and but the project is still moving forward, you know, and we're all just fucking excited, just nerd raging over this thing. Yeah. Well, speaking of reboots. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. The power grid is back, baby. How do they do it? How do they do their thing? Like, just kind of hold it. Like, like that. <laughs> yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Saban Entertainment is teaming up with freaking Lionsgate to bring Which, us. That's actually interesting, man. Lionsgate. They're known for for adding a lot of dark into it yeah know? and they have great concept concept people working in their production company so i'm excited to see how the costumes are actually going to look 
I doubt, uh, me personally, I believe this is going to be something new, something fresh. What do you mean? Uh, because they, they had to adapt it. If they're going to make money on a PG-13 movie, they had to adapt it for, for more. They had to kick it up to that extra notch that's not just for the hardcore fans. Right. Um, I'm expecting to see... It's going to be some, a bit more mature and a bit more darker. Yeah, I'm expecting to see like like different outfits. I don't think they're going to come back with like the, uh, the original cast names. See, that's what me and John were discussing. We're like, okay, well, how do they do that? So we were thinking, do they do the original... Like, it's just a reboot yeah. using the same names... Doing something like that... It's going to be the original costumes. They're just going to change it up a bit to no, no, modernize No, that's, no, that's the photo that was shown. No, 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 no. I know that. But I'm saying, like, they're talking about... Because you can't really alter it too much, you know, because it's like, hey... I mean, it's still going to be the iconic look, just I changed. The way to think about this is to think about how Power Rangers has been so far and that there's always just new Rangers. Right. I, I would... To be safe and to to guard your your my your Power Ranger fandom, so that you are not disappointed at an, for an official announcement, I think it's safer to assume that this is going to be like a fresh lineup, new new animals or or Zords. or at Zords or like it's going to be Ninja Magic Storm. No, they said it's Mighty Morphin. Unit. They said it's Mighty Morphin. Okay, dude, but that could also be for the announcement, you How know, because. So? Whatever they do now could possibly also nullify years of what was already laid down. You okay, know, I see what you mean. I see, I see what you uh, mean. The, 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 the road was already paved, and what we know from Power Rangers is that it just moves forward. Mm -hmm. Okay? They make the galactic ones. They make the, the police force ones. They make all these other, okay. other guys. They make the ninja ones, the wizards. So you're saying maybe this is something where... It's still in continuity, but they kind of go back to it. They, is I that what you're? Is that? I wouldn't be surprised if because I, I could see that if one the, with if the, the original. Season. If the original cast, I wouldn't be surprised if some of the original cast make, make appearances. That's or cameos. another thing. Well, you know, Jason David Frank's gonna be in it. You for, know, he for will. this movie, there's gonna have to be. I, I'm saying this; it doesn't have to be, but this this is my belief in it. There's gonna have to be like some kind of a passing of the torch thing. I uh, I like your, your your classic. Your classic hero's journey, there has to be like some kind well, here, of like because you don't watch it. So let me throw this at you. The current season is called Super Mega Force. Their their powers they have uh, Ranger keys that they're called, where they can call on powers from all the Rangers prior, and then they can morph into those Rangers. Yeah. So maybe it might have a tie into that. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be surprised if if these guys are the original Zords. Maybe, maybe something Zords. happened. Zords or whatever. The Zords are the robots. The, the original animal forms, like okay. the like the T Rex, okay. the pterodactyl, all that shit. Okay. I wouldn't be surprised as then because something happens. There was like some rift, and these guys had to come back to fix shit up. I don't you know. know. All I know but is I'm excited for the it. original cast itself. I mean, except for for Jason David Frank, you know, who else is in great shape? Who else is in great Emmanuel by Jones. shape? Which one's he? Zach. That Zach. Yeah, Zach is still cut. Uh, he's actually a bit heavy too, because uh, in the photos that they showed of him, you know, the, he's doing the firefighter thing. He's mm. got his family going on. That's Jason. No, not no. I'm not thinking about Jason, dude. I know which one is the All Red right, Ranger, right. man. All right. He's, think, he's not the porn one, which people are confused with. That's not the Red Ranger. No, it was that not, is not him. him. No, that's not him. It's a look alike. But uh, I say bring Steve okay, Cardenas back. Give him his time to shine. Which one? Steve Cardenas, Rocky. Oh, Rocky. Jack Jason's replacement. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> Blow him up. No offense, I know you did the interview for us, but that's the best <laughs> I like him. He's a good guy. Yeah. I just, like I told him in the interview, I feel they, that as a character, they didn't give him his, you know. That that wasn't a good transition. That now, here, here's my question White Ranger or Green Ranger? Oh, man. Man, man. That's tough, dude. Because they're both fan favorites. They're both awesome. Same man. character, but. Yeah, Diff they played different roles, you know. Yeah, Green Ranger was the villain for a while, then he was just became that cool kid. You know what? I think it's gonna be Green because dragons are just in right now. Mm. Dragons and Mechas, Pacific Rim, got Gojira just came out. That that's what's in right now. Yeah, yeah. Moving so, on, moving to on. things that are in. 
Yeah. The okay, new but, bat- wait, wait. Okay, no. Go ahead. Oh, I was the new bat suit has no nipples. Nipples are in because the bat suit has been revealed a few weeks ago. Yeah, Frank Miller style. Yeah, what do you Frank think Miller about style. that? I'm actually very excited. I love that suit. It looks more homemade. Uh, it gives it is. It's gonna have a grunge in this. That's what I'm expecting to it. Some kind of like like the gritty. Gritty. Do you is the not word see? I'm going for it. Is it like because you know Ben Affleck has that indistinguishable chin and and ch- uh, jawline. When he was wearing the cowl, do you not be like, holy crap, that's Batman? Or were you like, holy crap, that's Ben Affleck in a Batman costume? Yeah, actually, that's how I saw it. Okay. Because he, I was like, oh, that's Ben Affleck. Okay. Yeah, he's probably going to a costume party. <laughs> <You know? laughs> he's going to win um, first prize. <laughs> I, I, think, I think it's very DC. Uh, maybe not DC, because they, they did do different different costumes. Well, no, Nolan did his own unique uh, SWAT team style Batman costume. But uh, I don't know who's doing this concept. It reminds me of the Green Lantern, how how the the actual texture looks like muscles. Mm-hmm. And I'm like I'm like man, don't bring that guy in here. <laughs> At the same time, it looks cool, but I was like ah, don't let that guy touch anything with Batman. Whoever that concept artist is, is uh. um, but still because of the way the Batman the shield symbol. looked, like yeah. like it looked like like it was stitched on, and little pieces of it were like. Unfold. You, you, did you see it? It wasn't like perfectly laid yeah. in. It wasn't perfectly fleshed in. I think it was just a concept suit, you know. I hope they stick with it. I like it. I liked it. I, know. I really did. And I could see it. I wish end. we would have got a different angle, but for Zack Snyder, it's, just, it's a tease image. You know what I mean? Yeah. We were already told, we are already known that, that uh, they're just Batman or Superman. They were hinting at it anyways, that it was going to take from, from Dark Knight Returns, like the Frank Miller stuff. So... I'm really hoping now for for a good fight. All right, now, that Batman in particular pulled out all the stops. I can't remember. Did you watch Winter Soldier? Yeah, yeah. Did, did you yeah, like? We it? did a whole I, thing. I told you I can't remember. I liked it. I okay. gave, I think I gave it a three. And Captain a America three is set to uh, about to come out the same release date as Superman Batman. Yeah. Do you think either one of those movies is gonna budge? No, I, I think uh, Captain America is gonna make more money. Well, but I'm saying, do you think like because they're scheduled to come out on the same day? So do you think maybe Marvel might decide, you know what, let's move the date, or DC might move the date? No, it's going to be great for the theaters. It's going to be great for the theaters. Uh, what fans are going to do, they're going to be like, all right, I'm going to watch Batman Superman on this day, and then Captain America on this day. Now, my question, which one would you watch first? Uh, Batman Superman. Really? Yeah. I think I'd watch Cap first. Yeah, I'd watch Batman Superman. But then again, I hate, we haven't seen any footage for either one. And here's my thing. Everybody's like, well, Batman Superman, Batman Superman. Captain America already has this built-in fan base as far as the movie see, franchises it, go. It. And it's coming in after Avengers 2. We have no idea how Avengers 2 is going to turn out. Imagine yeah. the backlash from that. You know, if it ripples through Captain America and Avengers 2 just blows Avengers 1 out of the water. Yeah. Who's to say? I'm gonna, I want to watch... Uh, I guess I guess because uh, of my expectations, I want to see Batman Superman first. Because I want to get this out of the way. I'll be like, I want to see this. And at it the end, sucked. I'm going to make like, myself feel better about watching like, Cat. Like, all right, this is what we're going to expect from DC now. Mm. You know? Because uh, I'm telling you, that little detail that I saw in the costume, just looking at the ribbing on, on his arms, I was like, that fucking looks like Green Lantern. Not a lot of people said that. Right. But it's like this little no, detail. The only thing I saw fans saying that had nothing to do with the bat suit was behind him on the Batmobile, on the, on the fender over the back tire. Yeah. It looks like a smiley face, and they're like, oh my god, it's Joker! Like, yeah, because Joker, his face is part of the Batmobile. That makes total sense. Idiots! Thanks for that. Appreciate it. It's, come on, man. Yeah, I'm actually interested to see if uh, they'll bring in a Robin now, since they're, I mean, you're going Frank Miller. He did have one of the most, like, the fan favorite Robins. Yeah. It's like, why not? Let's see what happens. Yeah. Well, for this week, that's all we got. Join us next week when we talk more stuff. As always, <laughs> yeah. Why not, right? As always, We're everything. Talk about shit. Yeah. <laughs> Comicstreamix.com, the hub for everything, all our shows, pictures, locations, whatever. Comicstreamix.com, check it out. I'm Junior. I'm David. Talk to you guys next week. Have a good night. Peace.